Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Hopefully you guys are having a great day today. But today guys, we are back with Call of Duty Black Ops 3, man. So Black Ops 3, dude, it's so hot in my room right now. But Black Ops 3, four years later. And I still have a ton of fun playing this game, dude. Like, this, is, this honestly to me is like the better version of Black Ops 4. And it's crazy to say because, you know, this is like a jetpack Call of Duty game. But it's still like a better version of BO4. I don't know how you guys feel about this game. But I, I freaking love this game so much, man. Like, if there was one Call of Duty game that I would say that I could play for hours and hours and hours on end. It would probably be Black Ops 3. On current gen consoles at least. If, if Maybe if you're talking about like... You know, all Call of Duty games in general, I would say maybe Modern Warfare 2, but Black Ops 3, man, current gen consoles, I could play this Call of Duty game all day. And I did. Like, holy cow, I played this game so much. I skipped Infinite Warfare. I skipped COD World War 2 for like the first six months. So I played this game for a long freaking time, dude. But honestly, if there was one big complaint I had with this game, because this it was this one thing I, I just hated so much i could not stand it it had to be player collision i literally hated player collision with the bottom of my heart i could not stand it i would always get stuck on my teammates my teammates would get stuck on me and then for the most part i would end up dying because my teammates and myself we'd get stuck to one another it was like we were like glue it was like magnets so it was one of the most frustrating things i don't know what's taking forever to load up that's the thing with this game it takes like 20 years to load up, but we're going to be using the Olympia. We're playing on this map. Not a big fan of this map, not going to lie, but whatever. Look at this. Bro, both these fools literally ran right past me. Oh my god. But the Olympia... I, I remember one time somebody told me that when they got the Olympia out of a supply drop, they thought it was like the worst gun. I'm like, bro, what are you talking about? This is like one of the more like better guns in the game. This freaking shotgun, it is so... Good. I almost pressed L1 to self-heal right there, but it is so freaking good. I don't know. I do feel, in my personal opinion, Black Ops 3 is a lot better than Black Ops 4, even though this is a jetpack Call of Duty game. Just something about it. It feels a lot better, like, you know, gameplay-wise. It feels a lot smoother. Everything about this game just feels a lot smoother. I don't know how that guy didn't die. Honestly, I'm trying to drop all my streaks on these guys. These guys are not playing around on the other team. I think there's, like, a two-man on the other team. I'm not even too sure, but... Hey, you know, it's 2019. People are still running two mans in Black Ops 3. Unbelievable, if you ask me. Where do you think you're going, buddy? You ain't flying nowhere. Sit down. Sit your booty down. Ooh. I don't know how anybody could hate this guy. What? A hit marker? A hit marker? Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't know. I want to hear down in the comment section below. What did you guys think of Black Ops 3 when it first came out? I know... Well, I remember when I first actually heard about Black Ops 3 releasing. I remember, like, yesterday. I was at my cousin's house. I saw, like, the trailer. And I I was so mad because I was so sick and tired of, like, jetpack. Oh, hold up. Hold up. What? Oh, my God. Hold on. Woo! The Ripper in Black Ops 3 is so much better than the one in, uh, in uh, what's it called? Black Ops 4. But, yeah, I remember the first time I heard about Black Ops 3 coming out. It's at my cousin's house, and um, I saw the trailer come out. I was so disappointed because I was like, dude, seriously, we're getting another freaking Jetpack Call of Duty game. I'm not going to like it, but I was like, you know what? I'll give it a chance because I was like, you know what? I liked Black Ops 1. Black Ops 2 was really good. I'll probably like this. And then as you guys can tell, if you guys have been watching me for a while, Black Ops 2 was like the first COD game I started my channel on. And uh, ever since then, you know, I just I played the hell out of this game, and I've really enjoyed it. Okay, I really want to get my streaks, man. It's so bad. I don't know. It feels nice to play a different Call of Duty game other than Black Ops 4 for now. Because Black Ops 4, it, it just feels like every time I play that game, I can only play that game for like maybe like two, three, maybe four games at the most. And I'll just get really frustrated because of like, you know, the 150 health. I don't know why that's a thing in that game. Honestly, I feel like if 150 health wasn't a thing in that game, that game would be so much more enjoyable to actually play. But since it's a thing... It's really not. I always catch myself reloading every time I shoot one bullet out of this gun. Oh my god, how did I not get you? What? You're crazy, kid. Oh, dude, we are going off with this Olympia. I don't know how anybody could just hate on this gun. It's so good. It's coming right here. Come on, let me get my streaks. Woo! Sorry, teammate. 
I have to make sure I got my streaks right there. At least my raid. Oh my god. How is that a hit marker? There we go. We got wraps. I don't care if I die now. What are you doing? Oh, I'm dead. But see, I think the one thing I really like about Black Ops 3 a lot more than Black Ops 4, the streaks actually go ham. Like, when you call in your Wraith, if someone doesn't destroy like this jerk on the other team is, but if someone doesn't destroy the Wraith, the Raps, dude, like, your streaks are going to pop off. I don't, like, they're just way better than the ones in Black Ops 4. Black Ops 4, at first, the streaks, when they were out, especially like the strike team, dude, because the strike team, they went ham. They were so good, and then they nerfed it. Or some, I don't know. They did something to the streaks. I don't know if, like, they mentioned it in, like, a patch note or something. But they definitely did something to the streaks. Because the streaks in Black Ops 4, they do nothing, man. Like, they, absolutely nothing. The only streak that really does anything that's really kind of worth going for it. And it's not really worth it because it takes a long freaking time to go for it. Is the AC-130. Everything else, what do you think you're doing, buddy? I don't think so. But everything else in that game, it just feels like it does nothing, dude. Honestly, so. I hear somebody. Come on, dude. Pop out. A hit marker. I'm actually done, dude. A hit marker with this thing? What do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing? Dude, what the heck? Oof, the RK5. This thing's this thing is dirty, bro. Dirty. But one thing I really want to see in the next Call of Duty game, please bring back Final Kill Cam. No more best plays of the game. I, I miss Final Kill Cam a lot. You know for this game. Every time I play Black Ops 3, my PlayStation never sounds like it's about to blow up. But whenever I go ahead and play Black Ops 4, for some reason, my PlayStation sounds like it's about to blow up. Like bomb, like the bomb is being armed in Search and Destroy. That's my PlayStation. I don't know why it does that whenever I play Black Ops 4. For this game, it never does that. So, you know what? I want to be a troll. I'm going to go ahead. Like, if we get hunted. Okay, we're probably going to get hunted. But, I want to be a troll. I'm going to use the Brecky, dude. I'm using the Brecky this game. Hold up. This gun. I, like, I honestly don't think this gun ever caught a nerf. Out of all the time that Black Ops 3 was out. Like, I, I, I just... I've never seen this gun catch a nerf. And this was, like, the most annoying gun to die to. It was the most OP gun in the freaking game. It, it, like, I don't understand how the most overpowered gun in the game hasn't caught one nerf. I mean, what? It's so, it's dumb. It Honestly, the range is dumb. Just everything about the gun is dumb. I don't understand how Treyarch allowed this gun to be this good. But we're going to go ahead. We're gonna. I'm just going to troll people with this Brecky, dude. Can you imagine if we would have gotten a map like Combine? Oh my goodness. If we would have gotten Combine, like that's it, dude. That Like that literally would have been it. I, I don't know, man. But we're going to use this gun. Apparently this Thursday, we're going to be getting the Call of Duty Modern Warfare reveal trailer. And I cannot be more excited, man. Like, I don't know. The leaks have been coming out. It sounds like it's pretty good. It sounds like it's promising. I know I say it every year. Like, I know we always say that every year. Like, you know, it sounds promising. Everything about it sounds good. But it, I don't know, man. This year, it, it does sound promising. So... Hopefully it comes out. Hopefully it's a good game. And then uh, Call of Duty will at least somewhat be back up top. But we're going to go ahead. We're going to just troll people with this Brecky. I, I know I made a Black Ops 3 video last time. I said, who would use a Brecky in 2019? We're going to be one of those people that use a Brecky in 2019. What are you doing? Bro, look at this. Oh, my God. Bro, you put rapid fire extended mag like that is it dude you really don't need any other attachment on this gun besides rap fire and extended oh i'm telling you man once someone uses a brecky in one game literally the next freaking game like either the next game or the same game that you're playing everybody else starts using it it's actually such an annoying gun it really is it's annoying to die to it but it's really fun to use it like look at this like there's really no chance bro you're up close and personal like no shotgun really is gonna do anything Oh, dude, come on, man. What, what, what you gotta do that to me for, bro? But look, see, already somebody else on the other team is using a Brecky. Like, you, bro, once you hear it, like, that's it. That's it, man. Like, you better run the other direction because you're not escaping that. Look at this. Bro, my boy glitched out so hard, bro. What, what a G. I, I, you know what? I forgot how good glitch was in this game. They're gonna be spawning over here. Oh, dude, you just got destroyed. Feels bad. Wonder if they'd ever bring back Reaper in uh, Black Ops 4. 
Oh, dude. Rip in the chat, man. Where do you think you're going? Bro, you ain't going. No, like, you are not escaping this brekkie. I'm sorry. It's just not happening. You know what the crazy part is about this? About this? This isn't even a shotgun map. This is mostly like an AR, SMG. This just is not meant for the Brecky. But still, dude, it just show, it just shows. The Brecky is good on literally every map. It, I don't know. Oh my god. Like, come on. Seriously? This gun's never caught one nerf. Not one nerf. Wow. I wish I would have teammates like that. That would just destroy streaks like, like nothing. What? Bro, two games in a row, man. People just been destroying my streaks. Come on. You're dead. You're dead. Okay. All right, buddy. Okay. It just really happened, dude. You, you like, you see what I mean? There, like, there's nothing you can do with this gun. There's really nothing you can do about it. There, my wraith, my not my wraith, my freaking wraps are already gone. Oh my god, dude! Like, there's no stopping this right now. Imagine using a brekkie in 2019. Like, just pfft. nuts, nuts. The gun that's never caught a nerf ever. Oh, I hear an HCXD, bro. Uh, HCXD inbound, bro. Am I going to be the freaking magnet for those things? I'm always a magnet for it. I really am. There's nothing. Like, there's nothing you could do. There, there's nothing. And this isn't even a shotgun map, dude. But you know what, guys? That is going to wrap up today's video. Let me know what you guys think about Black Ops. Do you guys like it? You don't like it? I'm really curious, but... This game, man, honestly, I could play... If I were to choose between a game of Black Ops 4 or Black Ops 3, this game, I'm choosing it 100%. But anyways, that's going to wrap up today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please drop a like on it. Rate the video, subscribe if you guys are new. Share the video with channel growth. Thank you guys so much once again for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you guys are new to the channel, feel free to subscribe, guys. It's free. Make sure to turn on post notifications. You guys are upload. I really appreciate it. Also, what do you guys do with the bell icon? Make sure you guys check them out. Oh, that'll mean a lot to me as well. But yeah, we're getting the Modern Warfare reveal trailer apparently this Thursday, uh, May 30th. So that's in two days. Very excited, honestly. Worried, but I'm also excited. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Have a great rest of your day. This is Black Ops 3 in 2019, four years later. Thank you so much. I'll talk to you guys all later. Peace out, guys.